The Lynchburg Police Chief is making changes to increase safety after four shootings in less than a week. 10 News reporter Connor Dietrich is alive outside the police department tonight. And Connor, leaders say that they need the community's help. It's become a worry for many people out here in Lynchburg, losing their loved ones or becoming the next victim to gun violence. I spoke with local leaders and police about what they're going to do to ease the minds of residents right now. Four gun-related incidents in less than a week. The city of Lynchburg searching for answers. Councilwoman-elect Stephanie Reed says her heart aches for those affected by gun violence. That's a person, that's someone's child, that's someone's parent, that's someone's sibling. It's a life, and that matters to me. People are worrying their loved ones will be the next victim. Reed says it's about acknowledging and addressing. It's talking to the community, making sure people understand that we, we, are, we get it, we're concerned too, and then talking to the law enforcement community and figuring out what's the strategy that can help combat it the best so that we all can feel more at ease. Today, Lynchburg Police Chief Ryan Zudema says removing weapons from your cars will help. Zudema also believes in a strong relationship between the community and police. We need the community's help. These are community issues that we're dealing with that are only going to be resolved when everyone in our community takes ownership of the problem. The chief says resources throughout the department will move to the patrol force. This will allow the police to focus more on prevention. That has caused us to be a much more reactive agency than I would like. So to put these resources towards our patrol function will allow us to be much more proactive. Both Reed and Zudema say it's time for everyone to step up and end this crisis. The chief says that people can expect more cops to be in uniform when going out and about. He also asks that witnesses and victims be more cooperative in these investigations. Live in Lynchburg, Connor Dietrich, 10 News, working for you.